Hello everyone. Welcome to VI Developers. Thanks for watching this video. In this video, I'll be talking about our new feature called Voiceify TTS. So in this video, I'm going to practically demonstrate that how you can use Voiceify TTS and we'll also talk about its various settings and features. Firstly, in order to use Voiceify TTS by Tech Freedom, you must have to download or update Tech Freedom to version 3.6.5 or higher. One more important information that Tech Freedom version 3.6.6 .6 is now live on Play Store to download and update. This small update includes various bug fixes for Voiceify TTS, so you all are requested to update Tech Freedom to version 3.6.6 .6 as quickly as possible. These bugs are reported by our users, so we have fixed lots of bugs related to Voiceify TTS. So users of Voiceify TTS are strongly recommended to update to version 3.6.6. .6. So without any delay, let's talk about Voiceify TTS. Voiceify TTS itself doesn't have any voices or languages to speak. But instead of that, it leverages the power of artificial intelligence to smartly manage your own device text-to-speech engines. In short, it's a free alternative of paid apps such as AutoTTS or Multilingual TTS. It offers the same functionalities which are provided by those free apps. So without any further delay, let's begin the practical part. So let me open Tech Freedom first. Tech Dash Freedom. You have to update Tech Freedom to version 3.6.6 .6 if you haven't done so. So let me open this. I have already updated my app. So let me open this. Tech Dash Freedom. Open navigation door button. If you are opening that app for first time, like if you are opening this app for first time, you may have to follow up the login process, but I have already done this. So let me click on navigation drawer menu tech dash tech fe features oh. then you will have to go to features section and then uh, at the last you will find this uh, voiceify tts Vo voiceify tts button 17 of 17 so guys uh, as i have said earlier uh, Voiceify TTS doesn't have its own voice or language so before you start using that you may have to start with uh, you know set up languages and uh, this uh, this process you have to follow up which I'm following right now so let me click on Voiceify TTS button Voiceify TTS back button out of list battery opt allowing let app always run in background Okay, so if you are opening this uh, Voiceify TTS for first time, you will see this kind of uh, interface that which suggests you that allow Voiceify TTS to run in background because performing text to speech activities uh, requires this thing. So you have to allow click on allow button. Allowing tech dash freedom to always run in the background may reduce battery life. Deny allow button. Voiceify. So simply click on allow. Then before you set up any language it is required to set up English language. So I'm requesting you to firstly set up with English language because English will be served as fallback mechanism. Like if our, uh, uh, you know, AI models is failed to find any kind of languages, it will re return in English. So English will be used at any kind of uh, fallback mechanism. So you will have to set up English firstly in order to use Voiceify DTS. So guys, let's begin with uh, English setup. So for each setup, you will have to set five settings. First language, then synthesizer for that selected language, then voice for the selected synthesizer, then speed and pitch rates. So once you are done with selecting these five settings, you will have to click on save button. So let's begin with uh, English. So here there are three drop down list. First for language, then engine then voice so firstly you'll have to select language in order to load synthesizers or tts engines voiceify language colon heading drop dash down menu select pop dash up corsican up check touch english english open pair and drop dash down menu english open pair and then close parent okay so i have selected english then let me select synthesizer for this from the next drop down list uh, item Pop that select engine colon ETI ETI drop dash down menu ETI dash eloquence TTS. 
so i have selected synthesizer on the basis of language on the based on languages and synthesizer your voices will be uh, filtered like uh, if you selected uh, eti eloquence as synthesizer and english as a language so it will load all the english voices of eti eloquence tds so let me focus on voices voice colon drop dash down menu select voice colon so here i will select uh, english usa voice of uh, eti eloquence tds so english open pair in the united states english open pair in the united kingdom english open english open pair in the united states close pair in selected voice call in english open pair in the united states close pair in okay guys so i have uh, speed drop dash down menu english open pair in the united states close pair in yeah so i have selected uh, english as language it eloquence as synthesizer and uh, english united states voice of uh, it eloquence tds uh, as my voice so here you have to select pitch uh, pitch and speed speed colon heading so speed so guys speed uh, should be set here because uh, unfortunately voiceify tts has its own mechanism to ma manage speed so you can't use system wide settings for speed right? like you can't use vo uh, talkbacks shortcut to manage speed speeds like uh, slowing uh, getting uh, it like down or up so you can't do this and you can't also uh, use the text to speech settings default uh, systems uh, text to speech uh, settings in order to manage like speech and pitch rates so here you have to select speed in case if you want to modify the uh, like uh, speed you just have to come back here and follow the same process and set different speed and then you will be done so 20 slider so i have set it uh, here speed is already set like 20 so let me increase it 51 slider 70 86 slider okay i have selected 86 pitch colon and here i have pitch, pitch colon 20 slider so unless and until you uh, if you prefer like low voice or high pitch voice don't uh, touch it because uh, like uh, it is already set default as default so don't touch the pitch settings at all so yeah save button once you are done with, once you are done with the settings you just have to click on save tts settings are saved successfully so uh, we have selected uh, English language and we have successfully configured English language. So if you want to modify any kind of param para paradigms of English language such as synthesizer, voice or speed read, you simply have to select English again from the drop down list then uh, your different settings. If you want to uh, like remain the uh, remaining settings as the same, so just uh, select the same paradigms like uh, uh, synthesizer and uh, voices then if you just want to modify pitch then uh, speed rate then just only modify the speed rate okay so if you want to update the setting you can follow up the same process so let me Drop that blank voice of ITTS. so let me quickly uh, set up the next language okay so here i'm going to set up hindi language blank. Drop. So drop dash down menu, select engine. Engine. Pop dash up. Keep vocal. I'm vocalizer. selecting vocalizer. Drop dash. And kneel. Kneel as speed voice. 86. 51. Slider. So speed I 60, will prefer. 60, 71. Slider. Around 71. Okay. 20. Slide. And save. Save. ETS settings are saved successfully. So we have selected two languages. So we have added two languages into our Voiceify TTS. You, you can add as many as you want. So guys, it's time to test our settings. So let me open up the talkback menu. Talk back me talk then go to text to speech settings. Text dash to dash speech setting. Voiceify T preferred. Then click on preferred engine. Preferred engine. ETI preferred and auto T. Then click on Voiceify TTS. Okay, so my TTS settings are loaded, and uh, there 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 is small bug in Talkback version 12 and above. Like if you are using Talkback 13.1 or 13 something, so there is small bug. Uh, sometimes like Talkback is not applying a new synthesizer even even if it's uh, set by you know our system settings. So you just in in such case you just have to restart your Talkback. So simply suspend and unsuspend the Talkback. So you will done. Like we are using our uh, Voiceify TTS right now. 
so it is working perfectly for english and i have also added some hindi text uh, hindi language setup as well as so i will also test the hindi language as well as before that let me share you about updating settings which uh, about uh, which i was talking uh, previously so just go back to voiceify tts and if in case if i want to slow down the speed rate of my uh, uh, tts i can do it very easily so let me tell you how you can do it so so for so i want to modify speed rate for english language so let me select english then etl equivalents then united states okay speed is i want to set it uh, like uh, 51 so uh, let me click on save tts settings are saved successfully so it means if you are using that uh, language uh, it will reflect the change immediately okay so you can uh, get to know like uh, whether settings are uh, applied or not so my speed rate is like a little bit slow 51 slider but i prefer more speed though so 81 let me save set it again okay so it is reflecting the settings uh, real time okay so this is about updating settings okay guys so it's time to test our feature like language auto switching is working or not so for that i have selected a small text written in hindi and english both the languages as I, as we have set up on as we have set up only like two languages so let me speak out that uh, word so it is working perfectly like i have written down some lines there so it is working perfectly as we have expected it is reading english and hindi words so uh, for english language uh, the settings we have applied it uh, is being loaded and for hindi uh, reflect the same so that's the thing i hope you love our voiceify tts if you like don't forget to like this video and as well as don't forget to share our app with others and don't forget to rate us five stars on play store so guys uh, like it is a very tough work to develop this synthesizer so please help us by rating us five stars on play store you all are requested to rate us five stars on play store so all of uh, all the users are requested to share download and rate our app and if you are not then simply update tech freedom from the play store if you are using version 3.6.5 you will have to update tech freedom to version 3.6.6 in order to you know use voiceify tts betterly so yeah that's it guys thank you so much everyone for watching this video